A big congratulations to all the graduates of the second US-based cohort of the leadership journey. Well done. The world is ripe for new models of leadership. And these women are the future, leading boldly, empathetically, inclusively, and equitably. And I think what this journey has done for me is that it has taken me, my eyes, you know, out of the weeds and back sort of focused on my big picture of this vision of being able to shape healthcare for my country. It's given me a community of sisters is what I would call them, people that hold me up, people that I hold up. And I think most interestingly, it has helped me discover my power. A lot of the training and the lectures that we had, a lot of the coaching that I had, which had a major impact on the kind of leader that I'm becoming has really made me more introspective, uh, more calm, more compassionate, and more authentic. This journey has really revived a version of me that's been dormant for probably a decade. Um, the ideas, the excitement, the possibility, the confidence, the chance to meet these extraordinary women um, who have pushed themselves professionally with big ideas and big goals and just an incredible inspiration. This journey has really been a journey to self-discovery. Uh, personally, I feel more empowered. Um, I've had the opportunity to reflect on my identity as a leader, uh, practice self-compassion. We get to share and support and encourage. And we had this safe space that was created by Women Lift to be vulnerable. Um, and I can't thank Women Lift enough for that sisterhood. And women leaders um, can really make a change in the communities wherever they are and improve the better standard of living, better development in education, infrastructure, and health. And each one of you are lifting each other up. Also to the entire Women Lift team, oh my gosh, thank you. Thank you all for creating a space in which we could learn and uh, uh, comfortably share our fears, our vulnerabilities, and our strengths as leaders. I know that I am a better leader today um, at the end of this journey because you are. I think it's useful to see that you know, so many of us are handling different um, or similar problems in different ways and kind of think about how uh, there are lessons and different perspectives that I really wouldn't have necessarily uh, come across without having um, a diverse uh, group of folks to uh, to listen to, uh, really, and learn from. And so I just come away with a deeper understanding of the collective power of women coming together around shared purpose in a brave space that welcomes vulnerability and celebrates authenticity. The only thing I would change about Women Lift is, is maybe it's more like Women Gift um, because of the gift that you've given and uh, it's just been incredible. Compared to one year ago, I feel um, that I'm more grounded and I feel more confident and I've seen a lot of that in my peers as well. And I know that I'm taking all of that experience and all of that network with me and that will help me continue to grow over the years to come. Trust your present self. Trust your future self. You're more than capable. You're leaders. Your leadership matters. Women's leadership matters.